Teresa D. Hart here, Three Minutes with the Main Guide. And today I'm going to give you just a couple of key tips to uh, negotiating a rapid with a new bow paddler so that everything works out good and you're still friends at the end of that day. So communication, communication, communication. Now, if you're scouting a rapid and you're both standing there on shore, you can have all the discussion in the world that you need to. Um, but when you're in a boat, in the moment, that communication is going to be one words. It's going to be single words. It's not going to be sentences. The rapid is loud. It's difficult to hear. They're, you're sitting behind them. And so it's going to be one word and then you're going to have to communicate a stop for them. If you want them to draw, that's fine. What I do as a guide is I'll say, draw, draw, good. Because I want them to stop, have a signal to stop so that I can compensate for the drift of the boat, okay? Driving a vehicle with no brakes, okay? Whatever you do to steer, you have to stop and compensate for the drift which the sternman is the one that's going to be able to see that the best. So rather than saying right, left, where they have to decide, oh, oh, if I'm going right, that's a draw. I cut out the middle step and I will just tell them the stroke. So I'll tell them draw, draw, good, or I'll tell them cross. Now, technically it's called a cross draw, but cross draw, they might only hear the second half of that in the din of a rapid. So I don't even take that chance. I'll tell them cross, cross, good. And they know when I say good, that means stop. You can also do draw, draw, hop, something that'll carry over that din. And, and if you've communicated with your bow partner that when you go hop, that means to stop. And then the only other one that I'll do besides draw, cross, is back. And that means we got to slow it down because I got to take a look. Or we got to slow it down because I can't see around that corner. And so that's just kind of the key things. Those three strokes, the draw, the cross draw, and back and and just knowing and the other the only other thing that I tell them is once we descend into a rapid there's no paddling forward all you're doing is steering so canoe race season is upon us heck canoe season is upon us I started out uh, my husband was a really good sternman and I didn't know anything and just some simple communication things and some simple strokes that are highly effective, taught on land. Um, and then you can open up a world to your friends who are potential bow paddlers. So good luck with that. Keep spreading the force of how great it is to be in a canoe. And, um, and happy canoe season. I'm Lisa D. Hart, and you've just spent three minutes with the main guide.